Hi, I'm Chase Thompson Baugh with Simply Mac, your local source for everything Apple. We're a Utah based Apple specialist with eight stores in Utah, Idaho, and Wyoming. And today we're going to show you some more quick tips on the iPad that I know you're just going to love. And now I'm going to show you how you can delete a stuck message or email messages on your iPad. So if you have a message on your iPad, let's say in mail, I've got this one that says that I had locked my iPad and that uh, it's locked with my new passcode. That's fine. I don't need it anymore though, so I can get rid of it. Now, some messages you may have a little bit hard time uh, figuring out how to delete them. In mail, it's pretty simple because we have actually a little trash can right here. So I could tap on that and it would immediately delete. We also have the ability of swiping across a message and tapping the delete button here. That's very handy if you have several messages. If you also have a long list of messages you want to get rid of, you can tap edit and each one will have this little dot. And you can tap on that and tap a bunch of them down the line and hit delete. Now that's if you want to delete something from mail. If you have a note that you want to delete, it's just a little trash here. It looks just like the one from mail. But also if you have a message, like maybe a, uh, a message inside of here, it's the same thing. This one I haven't set up, but it would be the same idea of just swiping and then tapping delete. If you have a message in another area, like maybe uh, from Skype, you would just have to go to that application and delete it there. Some applications will notify you if you have a message, like for instance in settings I have a message. All I have to do is just respond to it. This is saying, that I have a software update for my iPad and I can tap install now if I want to or if I don't want to I can just ignore it. But if all these little ones or little uh, notifications are bothering you, come here to notifications and we can actually turn those off. Now this one for the software update I can't turn off, that's the only one, but for other things like uh, FaceTime, calendar alerts or games, I can tap on it and I can actually tell it not to badge the app icon. So if I happen to have a message that, uh, you know, say like in mail, I'll go ahead and uh, I'm going to mark this message as unread. So this message has been unread. So I have the little badge right there. Now I haven't read the message per se, but I'm going to come here to mail and I'm going to tell it I don't want any more badges. I don't want it to be there. It just bothers me. And now it's gone, even though technically I have an unread message. Again, I'm Chase Thompson Baugh with Simply Mac, and I've shown you how you can delete messages on your iPad.